one, it's Mardi Gras. Woo! And there's a popular Mardi Gras treat. That's called king cake. There's one secret ingredient in king cake, so I'm here at No-No Kitchen, north of New Orleans, to find out what it is. Chef Greg, king cake is the food that's most associated with Mardi Gras, am I right? Yes, it's uh, brioche bread with some kind of filling, and then you color it with the colors of Mardi Gras. It started in the mid 1800s, uh -huh. okay, as a uh, cake that was made to celebrate the 12th night after Christmas, uh -huh. uh, the coming of the three kings. The wise men. All right, well, what do we do? How do we get started? We're gonna start with some sugar, salt, and water, and we're gonna let this stir for a little bit. While that's going, we're gonna take some egg yolks uh -huh. and a mixture of butter and oil. And we're gonna mix these two together. Now we have the flour. Okay. The last thing to be added is the yeast. So after a generous amount of that butter. Generous. They're very, very generous. Very generous of you. We're gonna add some cinnamon and sugar cinnamon mixed together. Sugar, okay. So now we're gonna go ahead and cut this into uh, strips. Just turn it and roll it up. That's it. When I'm making cookies, this is when I start just stuffing stuff in my mouth. And then you're gonna do the four braid tuck. Here we go. You're gonna number these. One, two, three, four. Okay. Okay? So you're gonna start out would be two over three. And then four over two and three. Okay. And then one over two and three. All right, you want me to finish that? Let me try to help you. One over two and three. No. No. Two over, three over, four over two and three. No. Okay, <laughs> I got confused already. Braid these in together so it all looks like it's been... So it, it's seamless. Into the oven we go. We're gonna go ahead and put this in and we're gonna bake it for about 20 minutes at 400 degrees. In a king cake, there's one special secret ingredient, right? Yes, a small plastic baby that represents the baby Jesus. In the old days, they used to use a bean, right? They used trinkets, uh, mm -hmm. gold, uh, beans. It would usually be baked on the inside uh -huh. or put in after the cake was baked. The person who ends up pulling the baby Jesus out of their mouth, they're the one who has to throw the next party, right? Exactly. At the beginning of the festivity, whoever selected that would become the queen of the festivities. I see. We've got our king cake. So cool down. and ready to go and ready to be frosted. Okay. But first things first, gotta get the baby and put it in. Icing. So it's just, there's no real... Um, now you can go crazy. Just whatever, yeah. okay. Yeah, have a little fun. And what's the next step? Colored sprinkles. Colored sprinkles. Just colored colors of Mardi Gras, yep. Colors of Mardi Gras. You got the gold for power. That's right. The green for faith. And the purple for justice. Yeah, you're right. And then is there anything else to do? The only thing right. left is to have something to eat. All right, let's celebrate. All right, let's do this. King cake party. Oh, it's still warm on the inside? Mm-hmm. Wow. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Mmm! Ta-da! You got we it. We have a winner. That's Holiday Foods, King Cake. Happy Mardi Gras. <laughs>